we are here at beautiful Mount Kenya and today's mission is to dig up a driver ant colony to find the queen. We've already attempted this this morning and we failed miserably but we'll try again today uh, this afternoon. We found a nice colony that's a little bit nesting on a slope so the, ch the chances of finding the queen are still not great but probably decent. We know that the mission is going to be quite dramatic for all parties involved. Here's the rest of the team. Washington who has been working with us on driver ants at Mount Kenya for almost two decades. There's Patrick from Parler Research Center and there's Joseph. So we'll see how it goes. Here you can see the soil that the ants have brought up. This is where the nest chamber is underneath and you can see the ants streaming in and out of the various entrances to the nest. So Washington has started to clear away the vegetation and we'll be back in a few minutes hopefully. So we're a few minutes in and you can see the ants are pretty angry. They're streaming out of the nest chamber yet but we haven't hit the main chamber yet. So we'll see that's probably going to take another few minutes. But you see many many angry army ants all over the place. We'll keep digging. At this point we've dug a little trench around the colony and you can see that there's still thousands and thousands of ants streaming out of the soil. A colony like this can have several million ants in it, like some estimates go up to about 20 million individual ants for a driver ant colony. So lots of ants and they're very angry. Okay, we finally hit the chamber. I'll show you real quick what this looks like. You can see here the ants forming a bivouac uh, inside this empty cavity in the soil. And you can see how the ants hang together in chains. Um, of course, they're streaming out now from the bivouac, being very angry. And uh, I think I should probably head out because I'm getting overrun. So now we've opened up the bivouac and you can see that there's brood from the ants raining out. Uh, one of the main brood chambers, which is also of course formed of the live bodies of the ants themselves, has been opened and hopefully we'll find a queen soon. And this is what an army ant queen looks like. Doesn't look much like an ant at all. The biggest ant in the world. And here again the team. <laughs> Unbelievable, we got it. <laughs> 